Actually, there is a story I just thought of. I would love to see made into a movie or TV series. What was that? Do you know who Olive Oatman was? Never heard of him. It's a woman. Oh. So she and her family were traveling. I believe it was the Oregon Trail. They were traveling out west and um, some Native American tribe, I can't remember who it was, like came across their family and basically like murdered everyone and kidnapped her and her sister Jeez. and took her. And then I believe the first tribe that like took her treated her really badly, like her and her sister, they basically like lived as slaves. And then they were sold to another tribe. Uh-huh. And that tribe um, took them in as like family. And so she lived, she was a white woman and she lived as this like Native American. She even got the traditional tattoos on her face. Whoa. There's a picture of her traditional like 1800s outfits with the tattoos here on her chin. She got married to the kid. She was like, she like lived a whole life. She was accepted into this family and lived a whole life like as a Native American, I, th- I think for about eight years. And then eventually her brother found her and like brought her back to like, you know, like Western people. Whoa. But she never really like acclimatized back. And then her, she, she started the tattoos, so she became famous. There was a famous picture of her with these tattoos on her chin. Um, and just her story is so interesting. God, I would. I wish I could meet her. Right? And wouldn't that be such an amazing movie or TV series to like oh my God. hear about her life and what her journey? And the fact that she got the traditional tattoos shows that she was really like part of this yeah. world. Like she was accepted. She was married. She had a family. Like lived her life completely absorbed into this world and then was taken out of it again. What do you think she's like? Do you think she's abnormal or do you think that she's kind of collected the power of her experiences into well i'm I'm sure it must have been traumatizing her family got killed and then she settled and then got taken out again i I would like to know if i don't know enough about it like i don't know if she ever really settled back into you know kind of like white society or if she ever felt like she was part of it again because she spent her formative years right because she was 14 when she was kidnapped so she spent her formative years with this whole other world right you know 